everyone. I hope you are doing well. This is Nadia Mato, a 144 leader of Pastor Perfecto and Christine Padilla under the network of Almira Daya. Today, I want to share to you some encouragement. But before that, I want to read the passage in John 3.16. It says there, For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, that whoever believes in Him shall not perish but have eternal life. So I want to say to you that God loves you. Whatever state or season you are in right now, always remember God loves you. So now, have you ever asked yourself, do I love God? Let us read in the passage, Matthew 22 verse 36 to 39. Jesus was asked here, Teacher, which is the greatest commandment in the law? Jesus replied, Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind. This is the first and greatest commandment. And the second is, Love your neighbor as yourself. So here, God said to love him and to love his people. This is the command of the Lord that we need to obey. So before we can obey him, we need to love him. In the passage, John 14, 15, it says there, If you love me, you will keep my commands. So I'm encouraging everyone to obey the Lord. Be deeply in love with the Lord. Love his people. Be more compassionate, especially this time of pandemic where we experience rejections, disappointments, fears. Just choose to love. Spread the love, not hate. And in 1 John 4, 19, it says that we love because he first loved us. You cannot love others without the love of God. We cannot obey and have faith in the Lord without our love for him. So love Him first. Spend time with the Father. Prioritize Him in your life. Our love for Him is our expression of faith and obedience to Him. So it means that our love for God reflects our faith and obedience. So whatever situation you are in right now, just love the Lord. Do not be deceived by negativities, frustrations, or emotions that can steal your joy. But be full of of the love of God for you. Obedience is the key. And to obey Him, love Him. And always remember, you are blessed and you are blessed to be a blessing. God bless everyone. Keep safe.